What's up everybody, this is Caitlin here and I know it's been a while so I wanted to do something a little bit different. Everyone asking me about STEM, help with school, things of that nature. I want to showcase the other things that I do outside of that. So today, you guys are going to see my skincare routine. Because of COVID, this area right in here on my face has gotten ridiculous. So from the summer until now, I've been searching for a brand that can definitely clear this section of my face up and combat the oiliness of this T-zone of mine. So I do have combination skin. But what I noticed was with me wearing a mask, the dry areas of my skin were a lot drier and the oily part of my skin was a lot oilier. I went on a hunt to find great skincare products and I probably scoured the shelves of Target endlessly. And I found something that worked, something that didn't work, and then I was just over it. Until I saw something on Instagram. One of those ads got me, <laughs> but I'm glad that I followed the link to learn more and I was just hooked to this brand from Jump. So Jane is actually a woman who has a biology background. And when you know anything about biology, you learn a lot about the cell structure and how cells turn over, especially when it comes to the skin. So she put all of that knowledge to her skincare line. And her skincare brand isn't just for her skin, it's for a wide variety of skin types. And she offers a great range of products for everyone. The process of choosing products on her site, it wasn't too overwhelming because you're able to message them on Instagram or send them an email, just letting them know, hey, I have this type of skin and these are the concerns I want to address. Do you have any recommendations? And that's what I did after I looked on the website. I actually purchased the skincare bundle that's offered where you can choose the cleanser, toner, moisturizer, serum, and mask. I thought that was the best way for me. However, there are trial sizes available for you to purchase if you're unsure. But I went with the daily cleanser, the skin smoothie, the Dulce Flora toner, the hyaluronic acid based moisturizer, the glycolic acid um, mask, and the Ultra Glow and Protect Serum. Based on my skincare concerns and the ingredients, those five products aligned with the skincare goals I have for myself. Though Neutrogena, La Roche-Posay, those big name brands that you can find at Target work well on my skin, they worked well on my skin when it was in its best state. Now I'm in a repair type state, so I wanted to use something that was more plant-based because in the past I've had amazing results with repairing my skin in that manner. This is the Skin Smoothie Daily Cleanser. It's in an amber bottle for a reason. Though it does look pretty and makes it look really nice, there's a reason why skincare companies put things in different colored bottles. Um, hopefully it's not for aesthetic because oftentimes the color of the bottle is more expensive on their end. There's an ingredient in this product that will degrade if it's exposed to direct light, even if it's just the light in here. So if this, that's a great thing if this is the reason why she chose amber bottles for this particular cleanser. If this ever in a liquidy form, I shake the products because natural plant-based products always separate. That's just what they do. And I use a comb jack sponge. Now, this is a way to exfoliate. It's in its shrunken state right now. Um, it's a softer way to exfoliate as opposed to using a Clarisonic like I used to use in the past. While you're cleansing with this, it helps reduce the dry, flaky patches of skin you have on your face. Also helps with those of you that are interested in having brighter skin. So it helps slow away the dead skin without hurting your skin. It also lasts up to three months. Though this is not from the List Essentials, this is a Kojak sponge I've had for a while. They do sell one on their website, which I thought was amazing. So let's get into this. So shake it up. Since it's in a dry state, I'm gonna go ahead and wet it a little bit. I wet it, it expands. And once I'm finished with it, I'll just hang it right on the cleanser so it can dry just like this. You don't need to clean it itself. Just make sure you bring out the excess cleanser that's in it. So I'm gonna go ahead and wet my face. So my hands are clean. Um, if your hands, if you're doing it as a nighttime routine, definitely wash your hands before you do this. 
So I do a pump for my face. So this is just one pump of the cleanser. I massage it onto my face first, just so the skincare product is evenly dispersed. And then I use the sponge. I don't know if you guys follow um, the Golden RX Nye, the LA Beautyologist. Um, she's a black esthetician on YouTube. I have been following her for a while now and following her steps, even if it wasn't with the right skincare product, actually helped me out a lot. So having a four step um, face cleansing routine is feasible for me. And no, it doesn't lather up a lot, which is a good sign because um, even though there may be some natural ingredients that help lather, create a lather on your skin, it's not always a good thing to have those big suds on your skin. I go for, I try my best to do this for a minute. I'm getting all the areas on my face. And I know it looks like everything just got sucked up in here, but I promise it's a lot still on my face. So I'm just patting down my skin. So a huge tip is to also not wait until your skin dries out to move to the next step. Water helps keep your face hydrated. So this is the Dulce Flora Toner from them, from Level Skin Essentials. Um, I sh the directions tell you to shake this up, so I shake it up. Since this is a clear glass bottle, um, the assumption is that there are no ingredients in here that would degrade since light can get into it. So, go ahead and spray. And then I just wait until it seeps into my skin. It smells really good. And so do the cleanser. They're very light, natural scents. They don't have fragrance in it, which is a huge thumbs up for me. All of Nola Skin Essentials products come in glass containers, which is a great thing because glass is very stable by itself. So you know that anything that's inside of the glass is not going to be affected by the glass itself, meaning there's not going to be a chemical reaction between the product and the glass since it's just been sitting. It's also very temperature controlled. It regulates its own temperature in a way. So if you're someone like me who likes to take steamy showers, there's no need to really worry that these products will be affected. Time to speed up the process. I'll just fan my face a little bit. And this was another tip that I got from Nye was well, before you um, put on the mask, you tone. Like I've noticed the results are so much better for my skin. This is the glycolic intensive mask. Um, it is glycolic acid based. It helps to get all of the dark marks off of my skin to reveal bright, to reveal brighter and glowy skin. It looks like a jelly. I just keep it in its box. For security purposes, I don't know if you guys can see it, but I have the silicone-based brush. I've always had this. However, on their website, Noah's Essentials does have their own line of brushes. Having a brush to put on your mask isn't just for your face, like for um, ease of use to put on your face. It's also to prevent the germs of your hands and your fingers from getting into the product itself. I always start from the bottom and then there's just excess product. I'll just go around with this. Make sure it's nice and even on my face. I pick up any excess to make sure that it's like on my teeth on. Anytime I'm going to make sure I have a heavy or something on to protect the rest of my hair, just don't pull that more. So this needs to sit on my face for five to seven minutes. So this is going to sit on my face for five to seven minutes. And in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and wash this off to make sure I get all of the product off of it. 
and I'll be back. There's a scientific importance to using the same skincare or hair care brand for your wash day or for skincare because these products aren't just great by themselves, they're manufactured and created to be used together. So for me, when I was looking for a skincare brand, I didn't want to just like one product and then say, okay, I found my cleanser, now where's my moisturizer? With Lola Skin Essentials, it's all there. It's been five, six minutes. I always, always, always follow the time constraint on products, even if it's for my hair, because you could over process your face or your hair just because you want it to be a little bit more intense and you may get those adverse results. So always follow the directions on the back. They are there for a reason. This is so much better than my before picture that I took of myself. If I can find it, I'll make sure to put it in this video, but just know like I'm getting the results that I want in such a short amount of time. So this is the Hyaluronic H2O Cream. I like that it's pink. As you can see, like to get all of this out, I just put the corner of my fingernail in here to get it out. If you have like a little spatula, I used to, I couldn't find it, I would suggest using that. But I make sure that my hands are clean and my nails. So, from in here. Anytime you're putting on any skincare product, I usually bring it down to your neck area. You want to do that so your neck gets the benefits of whatever product you're putting on so your neck can match your face. It's funny to say like you have to drag your skincare down to your neck so your neck and face can match but you really want to help your neck out too and just put some moisturizer on that you put on your face. So the last step is the Ultra Glow and Protect Serum. Now you really don't need a lot of this. I'm going to put two drops on my cheeks and one drop at the top of my forehead and I just rub it in like this around and down and then this and then whatever extra I just put on my neck because I like the fact that it's very very um it's thick but it's not super thick um it's thicker than like almond oil but it still has enough movement to it to where i can pull it down if i need to so my face doesn't look super greasy y'all that was my whole skincare routine because i was talking to you guys as i was doing it of course it took a lot longer than normal but i wanted to make sure that you guys knew how i feel about it and some of the sciencey things that I noticed within the skincare brand. I love the fact that these are all plant-based ingredients because the earth can help you replenish your skin. But again, as someone that is a scientist, I know that all chemicals are not damaging chemicals to your face. So, Lola Skin Essentials, y'all. This stuff right here, this stuff right here, is like luxury, like super luxurious without the luxurious price tag. And this is something that is very sustainable for me as far as its price point because though it's in small quantities, you don't need to use as much as you would a regular skincare company that you could find on the shelf at Target. Their website is very insightful, not just to the ingredients, but the review. Those that reviewed every product, they don't just review, they do detailed reviews. So you know if it went wrong for that person, it wasn't necessary, it wasn't the product, it was probably just their skin type. And they said that. And you get to see how some people use the product on their Instagram. They have great instructions on how, how you're supposed to use the product and when. Some are specific for a day, some are specific for a night. So just be mindful when you're on there. And what I really like is that um, this company pivoted during COVID, meaning because USPS was taking a long time to get products and packages out to customers, they actually chose UPS to get packages out faster. 
So instead of me having to pay like the 15 bucks to upgrade my package to have like overnight shipping because they're right in Atlanta and I'm in North Carolina, it got here in two days. So that wasn't bad for me at all. And I just, I can see myself purchasing other products within this brand and within this company, not just for my skin, but for my body, because they do have body washes, lip scrubs, balms, you name it, they have it, and it's something for everyone. So, I hope you guys get to check them out. I'll make sure to link their website in the description for you all. And without holding you any longer, I wanna thank y'all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.